Hey all folks and welcome back to Let's Play Shining Force Final Conflict. Today we are ready to go, I think. We didn't even have to buy anything. Which, I mean, is logical. They would buy the best equipment before going out to the shrine. I hope. And I guess that's what they did. Let's go. Exit! That's old Shining Force 2 remixed. Oh, this place is dangerous. It's crawling with monsters, but they outnumber us by far. We should make this quick, then hurry to my secret hideout. I don't remember voices, I'm sorry. From one weekend to the next, it may very well change, even within the same weekend. Because I'm terrible at voice acting. Jan, as Ruberon said, let's make haste. <laughs> it looks like our victims have arrived. Capture them all. Meh, <laughs> I absolutely hate these guys. This could be dangerous. Could be, and of course you're not gonna help. Aha. Uh -huh. Yay. <sighs> okay, let's see. There's nobody new in the force, because we told everyone to shove off, really. Not really. Ruburan is there but doesn't want to help. And Cynthia's a kid. <laughs> what help could she possibly be? So, as far as new stuff goes, these are new. Dark Dwarf, HP 13. Is that good? Uh, it's two more than the Orc. 12 attack and 10 defense. Movement 4 is horrible. Defense is pretty much the same. Yeah, so basically they're slower, they hit harder, and they have two more HP. Nothing special, really. Oh my god, look! It's a pyramid! I am no, a tent. Remember Ribble? That's gonna be there at some point, but for now it's just a camp, it seems. Alright. Also, this, I guess, is Hassan. And there's a bridge here. Isn't that useful? <laughs> There's a bridge here! Yay! Why is it gone later? We'll see. You'll see. Trust me. Uh, so, right. I should probably just show you everything about the map. There isn't that much more. I mean, they outnumber us, but not by that much. Do they? Four, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, there's, there's four more of those. So, you, you kill these, you kill these, you kill these, you kill... You kill this guy, and then you end it, so kill this guy last, and... <laughs> Nothing special, this battle. Also, uh, forest makes you slow. This is probably just the first battle where you encounter forest, so I guess it also serves as some kind of tutorial. Although, with this game being a giant reference to previous Shining Force games, I'm sure they kinda expected you to know that already, because they expect you to have played the other Shining Force games before. Oh god. Page, you're gonna be so far behind, it's not even funny. That's old school Shining Force music right there. Kinda nice. Of course, it's the. Uh, <laughs> what is this? 8 bit, I guess? Or maybe. No, nah, maybe more than that. But whatever. It just, <laughs> it's just. It's the. It's the low quality version. This is a handheld. It doesn't have the same power. The same raw power. As I remember, um, Mead is awful at taking damage. And I think that stayed true. So I'll want either Yan or Paige tanking. Paige is way behind, so she's not gonna be tanking anytime soon. Guess it's gonna be Yun today. I'll put me there. I think one enemy can reach her, but not two. God, they're charging forward. Do I have Blaze 2 yet? I don't think I do. How well? What do you what do you have no? Well, Blaze 1 is still useful. Don't get me wrong here. Blaze 1's pretty useful considering the uh, low amount of HP they have. It's just not the best. Hey! Yeah! You go ahead and attack that tank. Oh my god. Yes. Awesome. I'm gonna have you here. Attacking... One of these. I don't know, I didn't check my uh, experience levels. 
Wow, um, maybe you should attack the goblin then. Ha <laughs> ha! Oh, wow, you Sunette, you're kinda awful Russ, all of a sudden. I'm gonna try to feed her some goblins, because otherwise I get the feeling she's gonna have trouble getting kills. Freeze! Would have preferred uh, Blaze 2, but whatever. I'll deal with it. Everybody's level 3, except the guy that just leveled. Knuckles is way behind, seems like. Yeah, certainly it feels that way. Alright. You're ranged, but... Stay there. Stay there and protect Howl! Please, uh, thank you. We're done with oozes, by the way, I'm sure you've noticed. And we're probably gonna be done with goblins by the end of this. I would imagine they're gonna be gone by then. Okay, hold on. You have 7 defense and 4 HP. Uh, I don't think that's gonna be enough to kill him. She would need 11 on 0%, so on 30% she's gonna need a lot more to actually do that. Which means... Uh, equip nothing and just battle this thing to weaken it. He still has a sword in his animation, but that's just, you know... You know, it's just, it just stuff happens. I could give you a kill, but that'd be overkill, so no. You just stay there. Oh my god, stop tempting me with this blazing. Oh. I want to blaze so badly right now. <laughs> okay, you need experience more than uh, Paige, so go right ahead and fail. You know what? I'm gonna give that one to Sunet now. I mean, I can, and so I will. <laughs> That's pretty much all there is to it. And then equip nothing, and you're also going to attack this. And that way I can give the goblin to... Uh... Better yet, I'm gonna give the goblin first, because it's gonna give more experience to her that way. Yeah, see? I'm gonna give the goblin, she's gonna get I don't know how much experience. But, you know, she'd probably level by killing the orc. And so she'd get less experience out of the goblin. If I kill the goblin first, I get more experience overall. Because orcs is still gonna give full uh, experience on level 4, I'm pretty sure. So I'm gonna feed her the orc as well, because it's gonna be really hard to f get her to kill stuff. Uh, you guys don't move from there, please. Mm. Defense 8, well, she could probably be able to kill hunter goblins, but I just don't want to risk having to feed. Okay, re-equip, but do nothing. I'm just gonna maintain this line here. It's perfect, everything's attacking him, and not doing much damage in the, in the process. Everything's perfect. I got this! Okay, you get to kill the other thing now. Ooh. Critical damage! Two! Two damage instead of one. Okay, 47 experience. A little less than I would have liked, I guess. I get the feeling Yun's not done taking damage. I'm going up there instead of right next to Jan, because I'd like Jan to tank some more, and I'm hoping the goblin's gonna go never mind, the goblin's not gonna go there, but it's Paige. Everything's gonna be fine. Ooh. Paige is so good. Okay, equip, spare, tag this fool. Hmm. Wait, did she get did she get three HP out of our level up? I wasn't paying attention. Oh wow, Jan's not the only one that can tank here. Or goblins are just terrible, there's also that. Alright. You can actually weaken this without killing it, cool. Do that. And then I can feed that one to- wait, what? Oh, critical, I see. 
I guess I'm gonna feed it. I'm gonna be feeding a goblin then to sun it. Guess you're staying here. You do that. If he did more than one damage, I would have been very surprised. This is Paige we're talking about. I mean, they're doing one to Knuckles, so... Go get this one first. Boom. Wow, seven. Goblins give more dam more experience than orcs? That's weird. How is that even possible? I don't understand. Oh well. I guess I'll deal with it. Knuckles, you had better get another point of mana soon. Also, Mead's totally gonna get attacked by this. Or not. Alright, whatever you say, game. I don't care. I'm gonna start moving ahead. Uh, not that much. But yeah, I'm gonna start moving my stuff ahead. Oh, you're gonna go after Yawn? Okay. I don't really care all that much, but that's surprising to me. I would have imagined he would have just kept going on Paige, but no. I guess they really like attacking Yan. HP 1, attack 2! There we go, attack 2. That's gonna help tremendously to just level her up. So I don't have to worry about it anymore, and I can just, you know, give experience to people who actually need it, like Paige, no, like Yan, who's only at 50 experience. Knuckles is getting there too, but yeah. Just, I'm gonna give experience to people that actually need it now. Now that she's not gonna be that hard to level up. I do want to keep her leveled up, I mean, she's the only archer, so she's pretty much gonna be staying until the end of the game. I'd rather have a good character than one that I'm constantly bitching about, you know? Music's getting weird. <laughs> the hell kind of music is that? Oh, hey. You gonna be coming this time? I'm ready for you. Totally ready for you. Come at me. No, kind of, no. He's thinking about it. He's thinking real hard about it. Come on, you know you want to. He doesn't. <laughs> God damn it. Come on, you know you want to. Okay, I know I want to. Get over here. 25, pretty decent. Not enough, of course. Oh, yeah, then I'm gonna have to tank. <laughs> I kinda like their animation, I'm not gonna lie. I kinda like that animation. It's pretty alright. I'm gonna put you here for now. And he runs away. I'm sure he was very impressed by the amount of damage I could do to him. Ooh. Very impressed with what Paige can do. Attack 1, Defense 1, Agility 1. HP would help you tremendously, go. Just saying. HP 3, oh wow. He can actually do more than one damage, and I was on 3%, 30% terrain, too. Impressive. Hold on. You're at 15. I guess you're gonna weaken the the Dwarf. I don't really want to give her that much experience anymore anyways. Yeah. Tempting, but no, there's people that need experience here. Uh, what's also tempting is freezing the, um... Uh, this guy over here. Oh wait, you need experience. Go ahead and take it. There we go. That's not the Dark Dwarf we need to kill to win the map, though, so... That's okay. No HP! But that was attack or defense too, I wasn't paying attention that much. Go Paige! Show us that awesome attack again. Alright. Oh, perfect. I want to feed this one to Knuckles, and this should be perfect. Yeah. Exactly what I needed. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Yan should be fine. 
Bam. Level 4, MP1. Excellent. Attack 3, that's also excellent. He gets 3 heals per battle now. That's pretty alright. Being, being very daring with her. She's not much of a tank. Uh, she'll be fine though. Alright, hopefully, normally the orc should be attacking Yan, which is great because that's just gonna focus all the damage on Yan, which means I'm only gonna need the one heal that I have. And you didn't even attack? What? Why? I don't get this computer sometimes. This AI. It's weird. Oh, wow. He dodged so fast, I didn't even see it! I don't think they have dodging animations in this game. Engine limita limitations and whatnot. <laughs> it's a freaking... It's a freaking handheld! Give it a break. I'm gonna give you the, uh, the kill. <sighs> it's a bit of an overkill, but... I guess you needed some experience. He got 2 MP, that's great! So, um... Mead and Page are below 50 in level 4. Knuckles swells. Mead, Page, or Knuckles are getting this dwarf. This dwarf that really absolutely does not want to get involved in any way whatsoever. I gotcha. Well, since he didn't attack uh, Jan, this is probably the last time I'm really gonna have any reason to heal, so... I'm not gonna wait until I take more damage. Okay, Paige does not need it anymore, Mead is not going to need it anymore in a second. Which means Jan's probably getting the kill. And he's taking the turn at the very least. And the kill. Alright. That works for me. Oh wait, you were above 50? Page, Mead, and... Alright, oh, that's not you. Well, whatever. You're, fifth. You're level 5. That's fine. Oh, right. <laughs> that was easy, wasn't it? You all put up a great fight. Any interest in becoming bandits? I'd love to have you on my team. No, but you could come on my team, dude. He'll be welcomed in my gang. Oh, look over there! A camp! What a relief! I suppose we should go there! Yeah, the tent that I pointed out earlier. Jan, let's hurry to the camp. Yay! New stuff, maybe? Wait, Ian! I want to come with you! Oh, her again? Didn't we tell... Didn't we, t didn't we tell you to rebuild the village? Are you done already? I, I couldn't just stay back there doing nothing. You're repairing a village! I was so worried about Grandpa. In spite of what you said, I've decided I have to come with you all. What? You followed us here? You're just a little girl. Now go home before you get hurt. What you said makes sense, Ruburan. But... It's too dangerous for Cynthia to go back by herself. We just killed everybody, God. And she made it here. Whatever. I guess we're gonna be babysitting a little girl. You don't know the half of it. I don't... I don't think I can help much in fighting, but I can use healing magic. No, you can't. Not much, at least. You're gonna be fighting more than healing. If anyone is injured, I can heal them. Well, Jan. What do you think? Should we let her accompany us? No! God damn it. <sighs> she is the only healer slash priest slash vicar of the entire game. Everything else is monks. And she somehow has the worst mana pool of all the healers in this game. It is ridiculous. I kind of like her and kind of hate her. She's the only aura user in the entire game. And aura, I'm a lover of aura. I'm a, I'm a healer at heart in games. And aura is the best 
healing spell in all the Shining Force games, and this is the only game where they managed to actually balance Aura, because Aura has always been overpowered, and they've changed it a little bit from Shining Force 1 to 2, but it always was rather um, overpowered, and in this game, and this game only, they balanced it, and they balanced it by giving the crappiest mana pool you could ever think of to the only caster that can cast it. <sighs> She's a bit frustrating. I'll respect the, the devs for actually balancing Aura properly, but I'm also gonna hate them for ruining Aura for me. Oh, I don't know if she's gonna stick around, that depends on her mana pool. She, I think she has barely 6 mana right now when she joins, and once she gets level 10... You're kinda lucky if she gets 10 mana. In like 6 levels, it's it's ridiculous. She doesn't always even get mana. Her mana growth is horrible. Thank you! Well then, let's hurry to Ribble Camp. I'm sure we'll be a bit welcome because a lot of people are there are from Hassan too. So yeah, by the way, she's awful at healing and she's also awful at killing stuff, so you're gonna be babysitting the crap out of her if you wanna level her up. And I'm gonna be doing that for the next few battles. I'll decide later if I keep her or not. I just kinda hate her. I respect and hate her all at the same time. It's I have uh, it's a love-hate relationship between her and me. So we're at camp. Didn't lose anybody. Welcome. Yeah. Cool. Let's see. Anything new? This is new. Pretty sure. Yeah. Sure. Cool. Take it. This guy. Yes. Thank you. Um. Do I have a middle sword yet? Let's see. Oh, I already... Uh, yeah, no. Do I have a hand axe? No! Oh, that's gonna help. Cool. New weapon. That's what I remembered. See? I remember that the first time you get weapons upgrade, Jan did not. So you had to keep him up early, otherwise he was just gonna fall behind. Pretty much everybody else gets a weapon upgrade. Yeah, see, iron's better than wooden, and she definitely needed the frickin' upgrade. Um, is bronze rod better than what um, Cynthia has? No. It's better than... no, it's not even better than what Howell has. Well, screw it then. Um, is that better than what I have? No, okay. No, I will sell some stuff. Okay, Paige has an angel wing I really don't want. 30 gold, sure. Uh, the short axe is useless now. And what else did I get? Oh yeah, arrows. Uh, wooden arrow. Cool. No, um, back is this button. Bargain, let's see. Wooden arrow and short axe. Those are the items I sold, I think. And I guess they're here because I can never get them again in the game. So, you know, the game's making sure that if I really want them back. That's mostly important for uh, spares, actually, because you don't always get the ranged. Alright, okay. Thank you, come again! Yeah, and I'm not ready, actually. Give. I saw that Howell had a full inventory, I'm gonna fix that in a moment. Uh, actually, pretty much everybody has a full, except Paige and Jan, I'm gonna give it to Jan. Don't worry, I'm gonna be giving most of those to Cynthia while trying to level her up. Uh, that's gonna be it for today, though. Next time, I guess we keep on going to the Bandit's... I would say Lair, except that's kind of evil sounding and Rebur and I guess it's kind of all right. Uh, Bandit... K? Bandit... Outpost? Bandit HQ? Ah, no. We're going to Ruburin's place, period. Uh, next time, though. Until then, see y'all.